Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, I'm wearing socks because it's it's pretty cold outside <laughs> at this morning. But anyways, the review today is about the Nerf Elite Search Fire. So starting off at the front, this is an Elite Blaster, but there's no barrel attachment. So you can't put any like a barrel or any stuff like that. There is one tactical rail, so you want to put your attachments or anything like a scope or something like that. I'd be going here. There's one sling mount here, one here, and one under the grip. So you want to run a sling and you know just carry it around with you. That would be good. And it and Nerf finally got the idea and wrote search fire on both sides. Before they didn't do that, but now they did. And same for the elite logo, both sides. And this is pretty cool. And it does have slam fire. So here's a priming indicator. So when it's not primed, you see it's black. When you prime, you see in there it's orange. So, and that allows you to fire once. PPU. And you can slam fire too by just holding down the trigger, pump back. Like that. So, yeah. So this uses the elite darts. Go ahead and get it real quick. Yeah, this uses the elite darts. So you can use waffle head darts. Those are the, the green darts, like 200 uh, darts for 10 bucks. Those are way more accurate than these things. So yeah, so it's a fitting rotating cylinder. And this thing looks pretty much like the sh new shockwave. I think mean, the new shockwave, the Nerf Elite 2.0 shockwave. It's literally the same gun, but the shockwave doesn't have slam fire, so. And it's the same as the Rotor Fury. I think the Rotor Fury has slam fire. I'm not sure about that, but yeah. Pretty much this thing is just a 15 rotating uh, cylinder gun. It has slam fire, which is a good thing. And it's, it's not too big. It's not too heavy, so you can hold it. And there's like a little sight at the front right here, so you can... So don't fly up your shots if you want to, but yeah, they didn't put this Nerf logo on both sides right here, so yeah, but who cares about that? It doesn't matter, but and the cool thing I like about the cylinder is the thing that says 15 right here, so you know you have 15 darts in your cylinder or whatever, but yeah, the, and to the grip, it's pretty comfortable. It's like a adult size hand, but my hand fits in this grip pretty good. So the grip here, right here, it's plastic, but it's pretty comfortable. But the only thing I, uh, you know what I'm saying, like, don't like is, it's just this thing right here. You know, it kind of rages your hand, but I think that's just to give more grip. So like when you grip into this right here, it's more, uh, you know, comfortable. And once you prime the blaster, you can't prime the back. So you pretty much gotta shoot the dart because there's no no damage button. So you gotta shoot a dart. Just like that. So yeah, now since the I finished reviewing the gun, now let's go to the firing test. So I'm gonna bring my phone with me real quick. I'm in my room by the way. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna leave the camera right just about there. And I'm gonna be firing a search fire. Slam fire and red room fire. Alright, let's go. Well, that one was kind of weak. And now slam fire. Out of bullets. So. That was the firing test of the Nerf Elite Surge Fire. I hope you enjoyed this video. And now to my personal opinion. Should you buy or not buy? If you're a performance guy, I wouldn't really recommend you buy this blaster because it doesn't shoot very far like any other like rival blasters or any stuff like that. But if you want like a good Nerf gun to play around your house or something like that or just to like light so it's a good size to carry around 
then I'd definitely recommend this blaster. If you want to buy it, you just go to Amazon.com, search up Nerf Search Fire, and uh, you can get yourself one, and you should be good to go. So yeah, I recommend this blaster. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe, turn post notifications on, all that good stuff. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.